Thank you. All right, this is another important lesson. Now, how did you tangle a bird caught in your hair? Woo! First, you have to have hair. This trend toward baldness negates the problem. Once you have grown a luscious mane, gather images on your lion tongue. Ripe peaches, sizzle of bacon, crisp campfire scent of an almost winter night, handful of rain or feathers or marbles, details of sunset, sand, and fast cars. Weave your materials carefully. Remember that birds like shiny things. The colors and flavors you choose may affect the type of bird you can lure into your hair nest. It helps to know what you're looking for. The hummingbird is popular due to its size and general friendliness. The swan is elegant, but angry. Loons, pelicans, and ostriches are obviously to be avoided. With patience, you will eventually find a bird snarled in your hair. It might not be the bird you initially had in mind, but give it some time. This one might surprise you. Protect your eyes and face as you attempt to pet the iridescent feathers of your albatross or owl. Avoid wearing a hat. In the event that you tire of this entanglement, the following options are available to you. One, tenderly cut the bird away, like a piece of gum from a child's hair. Two, start a small fire on the back of your head and then begin to run. <laughs> 